Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little video here where we will be going over some benchmark tests with the Sony Xperia Z and the Fuma 2.2, as we see up here, probably, hopefully. Uh, and we have the iPhone 5, iOS 7, Beta 2, you can see there, voice memo and all. Uh, so we'll be going over two jailbreak programs, 3D rating from Anto 2, and then also Gilk Bunge 2. <laughs> Okay, I know I sound silly when I'm talking. I know, sorry. <laughs> let's let's do this. Let's start off with the boring one first. That's it's not that graphical, uh, but still could be a little a little bit interesting. Maybe maybe maybe. <laughs> I'm sorry, people. I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. So Geekbench, I I think this is an Apple benchmark program more. Uh, and Apple too is a little bit more ish. Uh, of Android, I think, but I'm not 100%. You can never be 100% sure, it's pretty hard. <laughs> okay, there we go. We got a score of 2292. And I think the chipset we're getting in Xperia Z is like the Snapdragon S4 Pro, which is not as quick as the chipset that you do get the Snapdragon 600 that you do get in the HTC One. Uh, and also the um, the Galaxy S4. Uh, now, of course, the Galaxy S4 is coming out in different editions and all, but uh, we've talked about the default edition that most people will use. Uh, it's way slower. Uh, we notice that super huge difference in most of the times. Probably not, uh, but there is a difference. You can see here that iPhone is a little bit slower uh, in, in this benchmarking program. Let's try out more of a graphical benchmark program, uh, the Antitude 3D rating program, which is well both iOS and Android here as well. Uh, so we have the Adreno 320 GPU here and the PowerVR SGX 543 or something, MP3, I think, uh, inside of the iPhone 5. Let's do this, let's do this, let's do it, let's do it, do it. And we have this guy, he is standing there beating <laughs> in the middle. I can see the FPS is around 12, 11 uh, on the Xperia Z, around 40 FPS uh, on the iPhone. Of course, these are running in different resolutions, but we'll be trying out a different uh, test, uh, which is going to be more fair, uh, where they will be running in the same resolution, which is pretty nice. Because, of course, I'm pretty sure that if you have to render more pixels, then it's going to be lower. Just like when you have a computer, if you have a higher resolution and all that, it's, uh, it's like, I'm not bad, I'm not bad. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm annoying. Maybe, maybe I'm annoying. Maybe a little, maybe a little, little bit. Not super much. Do, 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 do. There we go, so let's check out the score. So we got a score of almost 12,000 on the iPhone 5 and a score of 5,000 here on the Xperia Z, but this one is rendering everything in 1080p, this one around almost 720p resolution, so twice. Uh, Q Commander 320, exactly, and the PowerVR SGX 543, triple core GPU and P3, I'm pretty sure it should be at the end, multi processing or something. Uh, we have a run off screen benchmark here, which is probably gonna make it a little bit fair. I'm pretty sure that they will be rendering everything in the same resolution. So we'll probably be in this little test, see them uh, coming at around the same FPS or something, because both have very good GPUs. Uh, the Adreno 320 GPU that you do get uh, in the uh, Xperia Z is the same as you get in HTC's flagship device at the moment, the HTC One. And also Samsung's uh, Galaxy S4, also has, one of the variants has the Adreno 320 GPU and that's the Galaxy S4 that I have. Uh, so very, very nice. There we go. So let's tap there to exit. No, I don't want to share my score. So we got a score to almost 2100 here on the Xperia Z, and we got a score of 2500. So 
much, much uh, more uh, fair right now when they were rendering in 10, 24 times 20, 48 on both smartphones. Uh, iPhone 5 still quicker here, uh, and GPU-wise, it's really, really good, and it's really nice there when you buy an iPhone. You really do know that all the app stores, all the high-end games is going to run perfectly on the iPhone 5. You won't see like lag or crazy stuff, I'm pretty sure, uh, especially not on the new games. Uh, so, very, very nice, very, very nice. Uh, have a good day, and uh, hopefully you will watch uh, my future videos. Hopefully you will be awesome and become a subscriber, and hopefully I will love you forever. Uh, I love you. You can tell me your feedback down below if there's any specific video you want to see, and I might see you comment and make a video about it, or just respond, or maybe never ever see it because I get so many comments, but it's awesome. I love you. Bye-bye.